And K2, a family picks up a dog for free off of Craigslist, hoping to give it a brand new home. But their treasure turns into tragedy. K2's Bob High has more on what happened once that family got their new dog home. Bob? Yeah, Deb, it's a warning for anyone getting a dog off Craigslist or from someone they just don't know all that well. It's also a reminder that when you bring a new animal home, it's best to take precautions at first. They said, you know, she was awesome with everything, so we figured she was okay. But Heidi Barnes's family was in for a shock. 20 minutes after picking up the pit bull mix named Jordan for free from its previous owners and dropping it off at her mother so they could buy a leash and collar, Heidi says the dog went on the attack. The dog was attacking the cat and the cat was bleeding everywhere and my mother was trying to put herself in between. The dog bit her and then potentially he killed the cat. Heidi's mom had to be taken to the hospital. The dog may have had behavior problems, but Heidi also took the dog right home and treated it like her other dogs. The idea is integrating them slowly into your household. Stephanie Collingsworth, a certified pet dog trainer with Multnomah County Animal Control, says putting a new unrestrained animal in your home can be trouble. The animal doesn't know the rules of the house. There's other pets involved in the house. So integration slowly is a really good idea. We generally recommend about two weeks of just sort of taking it easy and getting to know the animal before you start giving them freedoms that your, say maybe your resident pet or your previous pet had. Heidi plans on taking legal action against the people who gave her the dog to cover her mom's medical bills. Definitely because we have the posting from Craigslist and we have everything else saying this dog is a good dog and by far it's not. The big question, can you be liable for handing over an animal that ends up attacking someone? If it has a documented history of similar problems and you don't tell the new owner, maybe. But for the most part, animals of any kind, Deb, are sold or given away as is. So what happens to this dog? In this case, uh, it'll be held for 10 days in isolation and then probably will be given back to the original owners. All right. Bob, thank you.